you suffer from performance anxiety? No, not that kind of performance anxiety. I'm talking about the brand of performance anxiety that comes from not being able to finish a track. Yes, you know who you are. You're the poor sap who just can't get past an eight bar loop. Hello friends, this is Tom Goodson, AKA Ignaga Gogo, along with Earl Smith, AKA DJ Molotov, to my left. But you can ignore him, he doesn't talk too much. I'm here today to discuss a problem most of us are all too familiar with, and that is the problem of finishing tracks that you start. Oh sure, you're probably saying to yourself, but Tom, I've got over 1,658 16 bar loops on my hard drive, and they're fire. Well, let me tell you something there, Mr. DJ Funny Man. 1,658 16 bar loops doesn't mean deck. Without one single completed track, you got squat. Whether you're a veteran and can't finish the track you're working on, or if you're just a dribbling newbie who is stuck on your very first track, I have a system that could work for you. You know, it wasn't all that long ago that I was a sap just like you. I had dozens and dozens of 8 and 16 bar loops that were mega fire, but I just couldn't achieve that holiest of holy grails, a finished track. Like a chimp idly playing with his nads, I was always distracted by every shiny object that came along. Or my other tired old excuse, this track sucks, so I'm going to start another one that sucks less. How many times have you heard this one on the Facebook group? Let me tell you something, DJ Dipshit. Your first finished track isn't going to be a number one hit of the year. So skip the drama. So you're probably asking yourself, Tom, when are you going to shut the fuck up and get to the point? The first thing you need to do is pick one of the dozens of fire loops that you have and commit to it. Or just make a new one. But after you commit, you'll work on this one track and nothing else. Did you hear that? Nothing else. That's how I finished my first track. I decided come hell or high water, I was finishing this track. Nothing was going to distract me. Nothing was going to stop me. And remember, the goal here is not to produce a track that gets more listens than Dead Mouse or Cascade. The goal is to finish this track. It doesn't matter if you finish it in two days, two weeks, or two years. It has to be finished before you move on to creating another useless fire loop. So you could be saying to yourself, Tom, I don't know how to do everything. My mixing sucks. Or my drum programming sucks. That's okay, friend. When you're working on this track and you get to the drum programming part, Take that time to bone up on drum programming and get it done for this track. But do not get off this track. And the same thing for synth programming or whatever. When you get to that part, figure it out, add it to the track, but do not get off this track. That's what I did. And after only a couple of weeks, I had a finished track, composed, arranged, mixed, and mastered. Everything I did for two weeks was related to this one track. I didn't deviate from the goal, and you won't either. Unless you're a girly man and can't finish this track. So let's bring in DJ Skipper and see what he says. Skipper, did you finally finish your first track? Yes, I did, Eggnog, and I did it like you said. So you didn't get distracted by dicking around with your other fire loop ideas? Oh, uh, that's right, Eggnog. I didn't mess around with anything else. I saw it through, and now I feel like a real man. Well, that's great, Skipper. Now get the hell out of here and finish another. Well, there you have it, colleagues. If DJ Skipper can finish a track, so can you. Of course, I don't know everything, even though I have a doctorate in psychokinesis. But let me tell you this, friends. If you want to finish your first track, try it this way. It works. In between tracks, you can do whatever you want. But once you commit to a track, it has to be finished. Or why did you commit to it in the first place? Because it sucks more now than it did then? To this day, 
I still use the system because it's the only way I can get my tracks in the can. I work on one track and one track only at a time. So, why don't you try it? You're not chicken, are you? Ha 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 Well, I hope you enjoyed this little talk as much as I have. And I hope you'll get off your ass and finish that track and stop making limp excuses on Facebook. This is Tom Goodson, a.k.a. Eggnogagogo, signing off for now. See you later, friends.